A common hazard of being a beginning video editor is losing files, or worse, not remembering what file had the clip you needed because it's named some absurd techno alien language. So you might think, okay, it's fine. I can see the file just fine. This is fine. It's not fine. There is a better way to do this, and let me show you. Once you've imported your videos to the appropriate folder, you can batch rename files with Automator. It's standard on most Macs. Just search for it in your application folder or using the search spotlight. Once opened, hit Command N to make a new workflow, like this. In your original folder, drag your video files to the main screen. Search for Rename Finder Items in this panel and drag it under your files. Under the first drop-down menu, hit Make Sequential. Select New Name. And then enter the date you filmed your clips by year, month, and day, followed by a brief description. I recommend adding dates when working with a lot of B-roll over a long period of time, but you're welcome to name your files whatever works best for you. You can place the number after your name, I mean, I prefer after, but your call. Have them start at one, and then it's a good idea to make them two digits long. Once you're all set, hit run, look at your original folder, and voila, your files are fancy and renamed. If you make a typo, or you decide to rename your file something else, simply erase your get specified movies file, and then drag in the newly named files and start the process all over. Then take those files, drag them into your edit software, and happy editing.